There have been continued allegations that Ruttle Corps is going bankrupt. Eric Manchester, the Ruttle's press agent, are these allegations true? No, no. No, they're, uh, they're conjecture, you know. They're, they're sort of rumour. I think you find the way you get success, you'll always find this sort of rumour. No. So the stories of the theft, they're not true also? Uh, no, they're greatly exaggerated, greatly exaggerated. Uh, it's bad, you know. Things are going. But uh, nothing like the rate that, that people indicate. The trouble is that people feel that because, because these boys are the Ruttles, people can come in and just help themselves to whatever they want, and this is just not on. And we're putting a stop to this, and we are doing, you know, it, it, it's almost dried up. Uh, things have gone. I won't deny it. Television sets. The odd car belonging to the company has, uh, has disappeared. But uh, it's not extreme, you know. Oh, well, I did come in once. I found that my office had been nicked. Mm -hmm. But it had been nicked by, uh, by Ron Decline, who we'd called in to stop this sort of uh, flow of goods from the building. So that was all right. Mm. So once you see this stop, do you feel that Ruttle Coal will continue into the future? Absolutely. I feel that once we've put a stop to this sort of bit of petty pilfering, Ruttle Coal will last for a very, very, very...